Hey guys, it's Puffy Bricks. Welcome back to another video. I hope you enjoyed that mock. In this video, I have a haul from Area Light Custom Works. So, before I start the video, um, first off, it's not sponsored, obviously. Secondly, um, wow, just, I'm surprised. I ordered this May 17th, and it arrived on May 23rd, so that's just kind of crazy. I mean, they come from Taiwan, so think about that. I've also ordered from AB Figures and Claramie Customs, and they took, like, 10 days each to ship, which is really crazy in comparison for six days from like i don't know twenty thousand miles away i don't know, really know geography all right so here's the package it's not all yellow mail poster it's not too much stuff so we'll open it up if you're wondering about where this is this is my custom figures desk this is where i design all my custom figures i cut them with the cutting board all that stuff, organize all of them in the background in those drawers. So, make sure there's no hinders. My address don't want to see that. Alright, and so here is the hull. Keep all the tools that I need for the figures. Those are also there. So I'll pour this out. It's, uh, oh, so um, first off, just beyond the shipping, they also sent me this. Uh, I think this is the mullet hairpiece um, in white for free. Um, wow, just really wow. Their service is quite excellent considering that they are just so far away. All right, so we've got one, two. Three, four, five, six items here. And, um, let me get that go. There we go. So I'm just getting out my other TV figures. So here I actually have a Commander or Captain Thorn. I don't really remember which one it is. I think it's Commander Thorn. Um, helmet. So when I originally got it, I had gotten the wrong visor, so today I got the correct one in black. So we'll throw it on the minifigure head. What did I get the wrong one again? No, I got the right one. So yeah, here it is. It's kind of bulky, but it's how it is in the show, so quite nice. And pull it back through the head. I'll end up making a custom body for that at some point. Um, all right, so let's get to the main press motor. So first off, we have the black dark blade, also known as the um, uh, yeah, I guess the dark saber is the word. Um, as you can see down here, it's got a very long hilt. Um, here let me grab Darth Maul on the back since he would have held this. Yeah, so here it is. It looks. The printing on that thing is just really amazing. Not sure if it's marble um, molded or printed, but it is really nice. So I'll probably end up uh, painting the bottom part silver or um, just leaving it as it is. I'll probably paint it though. I'm definitely going to be clipping some of this off the end because it is way too long. All right, let's move on to the next part of the wall. This is the Purge Trooper helmet from Jedi Fallen Order. It has the airborne helmet uh, mold, but with the Purge Trooper markings. Let me see if I can find a, uh, never mind. Uh, yeah, so it has the nice red accents there, which signifies it is a captain. There we go, focus, focus, there we go. So yeah, it's really nice, I'll use it. And I get a fall in order creation at some point. Probably not within the next two or three months. So next up, we have the Art Trooper Gessy helmet. And I actually already have one of these from Clonarmy Customs. But if you compare them, this one is like a much smaller version. So this, oh yeah, wow. This looks a lot better on there. It's a little bit bulkier, but the proportions are a lot better with everything else. Like the um, cloth and yeah. So next up, we have Arc Trooper. Oh, also this one just released uh, when I ordered this. 
along with the um, 332nd helmet and one other helmet, which I got. So this is Arc Trooper 5's helmet. Uh, he's a great character in the Clone Wars, appears in the first uh, five seasons before he is, spoilers, um, killed. And yeah, so here he is. He's got the nice printing on top, full 360. Once again, area light. Um, I prefer the Mulder Climbing Custom perfectly, uh, per personally, but um, Climbing Customs has a much greater so selection of various helmets. So that's why most of these in the background are Climbing Customs. Put that on the side. All right, and lastly, here is the other helmet they released that day. This is the um, Lieutenant Echo helmet from the Bad Batch series in the Clone Wars. This is when he gets the armor and helps them uh, destroy the codes that the Separatists took from his brain. So yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys. Uh, this has been Pofi Bricks, and have a good one.